Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. Firstly, I'd like to wish every single one of you guys a happy Hallows Eve. Um, this is the beginning of the seasons, right? <laughs> the holidays. So I hope you guys are as excited as I am. Anyways, so let's get into your reading, Leo. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of October 2021. Spirit guides, ancestors, archangels, please step forward and guide us. Allow us to see clearly and concisely what is unfolding for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, one more shuffle. Here we go. Let's get into it. We're starting off with the Justice card. So Justice could represent um, balance. It can also represent getting to the point of feeling like you are being vindicated in regards to a situation where you felt like you were mistreated um, or were treated unfairly. Your next card here is the Four of Wands. Okay. So there is a higher type of elevation. For some of you guys, this is commitment. Uh, this is coming to the understanding that there is a need to take it or make it official. Uh, for those of you guys that have been dealing with someone casually, this is definitely taking it to the next level. Uh, this is becoming publicly official. Um, for those of you guys that have been in a relationship for quite a while, there's definitely a balancing of scales here. There is a decision that is being made in regards to this commitment and the longevity of this uh, relationship. Um, now, for those of you guys that are single, I definitely do see you guys being more focused or being more concerned in regards to, um, like I said, longevity is what I'm hearing. So for some of you guys, this is getting to the, um, you know, starting to view relationships or even uh, prospects or suitors um, really with a, with a keen eye on what it is that they want moving forward because I feel like you guys are to the point where you're not wasting any time. You know exactly what it is that you want and that is exactly what you're asking for. Uh, with the Five of Wands, this is definitely people fighting for your attention, Leo. This is people really trying to get your attention, wanting to spend time. Uh, this is definitely talking about multiple suitors for the month of October. Yep, exactly what I was saying. We have the Seven of Cups here. So I definitely do see, for some of you guys, you may be dealing with a Libra. For others of you, you may be dealing with a Sagittarius, Aries, or a Leo like yourself, or Water, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But I definitely do see a lot of people really trying to get your attention. Um, but I feel that more specifically for some, for some of you guys, especially those of you guys that have been uh, single for quite a while, if you felt like at some point love life was a bit dead, that's no longer going to be the issue. You're you're getting options is what they're saying. Options and opportunities, okay? Take advantage of this. Even if you feel like you are not really interested in someone, give yourself the opportunity to have fun. That's how you need to approach relationships moving forward, having fun. Um, why? Because if you don't, it's okay and it's a beautiful thing when you know exactly what it is that you're looking for. However, it's very difficult to be able to get to know someone on a first date or on a first impression. So if you feel like you, you know, maybe are not clicking well enough with someone, you don't really know what can come from that because you're not allowing yourself to get to know that person. So again, take full advantage of these opportunities that are going to be coming to you. Uh, Leo, not only when we're talking about relationships, but we're also talking about career and finances. There's definitely opportunities that are going to be opening up. And I feel that uh, more than likely there is a higher superior, someone that is um, of a higher ranking position that is going to be relying on you for the month of October. There is something that is going to be unfolding where they feel like they can't fully um, have everything under control. So there is a need, almost a panic mode, of wanting or needing someone to step up and I definitely see you stepping up and that's a beautiful thing why because you're showing them that you have grit that you have uh, what it takes to think on your feet Leo so th this is awesome energy because I feel like when we're talking about um, 
when we're talking about anything that has to do with competition or people around you, it's like they're non-existent. Why? Because you're the one that's going to be taking center stage for the month of October, Leo. Uh, Princess of Cups here. So I feel like there is a lot of opportunities when we're talking about love and romance. Uh, like I said, for those of you guys that have been in long term, this is higher commitment. So I wish you guys the very best. I hope you guys have an amazing, amazing October and we'll see each other soon. Bye.